Side of an MUA. So I have this look for you guys going on here. Just a bright, colorful look. Um, I just been feeling color today, so I decided to do this look for you guys. And it's pretty much just a raspberry dazzle type look going on. And um, that's what I got going on. And on my lips, I was recently sent some products from Black Up Cosmetics, and this is one of their lipsticks. And the color that I'm wearing is number 38M which is a matte type raspberry lipstick right here. Really, really love Black Up Cosmetics lipstick and their matte formula. It's not drying, but it still has that matte finish. Because I know sometimes with matte lipsticks, you can always get the um, dryness. And um, this one does not do that. And I have a swatch for you guys right here. And this is number 38M. And I will definitely um, post the link down below where you can purchase this lipstick right here from Black Up Cosmetics. All right, we're going to go ahead and get into the tutorial. Uh, I'm also going to try to do a voiceover. Normally, I don't, um, not, not able to because i got kids. I'm a single parent of two, and I just, it's just hard for me to do it because you'll be hearing my kids in, in the background. But since I'm kid-free for today, I will try to do that for you guys. And if I am successful, comment down below and let me know if you want to see more voiceovers or um, talk-throughs or whatnot. Um, post your comments down below and um, all right well let's get into the tutorial don't forget to like comment and subscribe and don't forget checking out on Instagram at the side of the MUA okay so I'm taking the Milani um, eyeshadow primer and applying it all over my lid and just blending that out up into the brow bone area And then I'm taking NYX um, eyeshadow base in white and just applying that with a synthetic brush and then blend that out with my fingers. Okay, I'm taking the NYX uh, primal color in hot orange and using a Sonia Kashuk blending brush, just blending that in my upper crease area and just blending out that eyeshadow. Okay, here I'm taking a Coastal Scents Hot Pot in Wild Raisin and also using a fluffy blending brush from Sonia Kashuk and putting that in the outer V area and blending that product out. Okay, I'm taking my Too Faced Chocolate Bar um, palette and going in with a deep plum shimmery color and a fluffy brush and going in the crease area and deepening the crease area with that color. Okay, now I'm taking my Sugar Pill um, poison Plum Eyeshadow, which is a matte purple eyeshadow, one of my favorites. And just applying that in my tear duct area and also my outer V area. And then I'm going to go ahead and blend those, uh, those products, that eyeshadow out with a fluffy blending brush. Alright, I'm taking my BH Cosmetics. Um, 120 palette in the second edition, taking a um, pink color, a matte pink color, and adding that in the middle lid area, and just packing that color on and blending in with the purple. Okay, I'm taking my City Color Blush Quad in collection number two and using this matte reddish orange color. And I really wanted to make that orange pop above my crease area, so I just kind of pop that on there 
and um, blended that out with my Sonia Kashuk blending brush. Okay, so I'm going in my Z palette and getting a Coastal Scents Hot Pot and Oatmeal Tan, using that as my highlight color, and then blending that down into my orange that I just applied. Okay, I got my MAC um, Reflex Glitter and Pearl. Um, and I'm also going to take my Spray My Brush with my ELF Mist and Set. And that will help apply the product and let it ad adhere to my mobile lid area. Let's go ahead and just really lightly pack on that color in the middle just to give it a little sparkle on that pink. Okay, and taking more of that MAC Reflex Glitter and applying that in my tear duct area. Okay, taking my favorite liquid liner from NYC. This is a black liquid liner. And just go ahead and creating my wing, which is, you know, pretty much draw a small line going out and then dragging it inward and then slowly working your way to the tear duct area. Okay, just pop it on a little bit more of that uh, Sugar Pill uh, Poison Plum Purple, just to emphasize on some more of that purple in that area, and then blending that out. Okay, going in with a Coastal Scent Hot Pot in Indigo, which is one of my favorite purplish blue colors, and popping that on the bottom waterline area of my eye and then just blending that out all the way to the tear duct area. 